pretty much what you expected today to better ours? No, that's what I expect. It's what I work for. So I'm going to always just try to have my expectation high because I put the work in for it. Are you taking a little time away from school to like being back home? Excuse me? You're taking a little time away from school to like being back to that? Um, it's just good to see everybody face again, good to see the coaches and just be back in Boston. Um, missed the weather a little bit. It's kind of hot down there, so <laughs> needed to cool down. The one thing I've, I've noticed just watching you around here today, being around you the last three years, you don't change, man. No matter what, <laughs> you're still the same dude. What, what do you attribute that to? Uh, I just, that's just me. So I, I don't even know what to say, so like, I'm just like a, see everybody smile, see everybody happy, go put in work and do my job, so uh, that's what it is. <laughs> I can't really tell you. How has training been like for you since the season ended up until now? Did you put on a lot of muscle? Uh, it's been fun. It's like a moment I've been waiting on, just be able to train, don't really have school, put work in and play football and like prepare for my dream. They obviously work with the Patriots at the Shrine Bowl and they're, they're here today. I'm just wondering if you had any more contact with them in this process and I always like to see them again. Uh, not a lot of contact. I said what's up to um, the coach today because I seen him at the Shrine Bowl, but not really a lot of contact. And just uh, some of the routes that you're running, was, you know, what was to try kind of the goal here today? You know, to uh, show just show something different, like uh, dynamic at all parts of the field, like underneath, intermediate, deep balls, and just show off everything that I showcased on film. What was it like to have Emmett there throw with you? Uh, it was a great moment to have him there because Oh, we didn't really have a quarterback that was coming out this year, so just to have him out there and be able to share that moment with him was um, great because he's the next one up. Obviously, you've had a lot more attention on you this last you know, month, two months, whatever it is. How strange has that been for you, or is it just you know, another day? Uh, yeah, it's just another day. I just wake up and go to work every day, not really think about it. Don't let it like, get to my head. Just do what I do every day, and, and everything will pay off. Zay, what should teams know about you that they can't see on film or in measurements and, and things like that? Um, you're going to get a good person on and off the field. Uh, you're going to get the best version of like a player that you want. Everything you see is what you get. Zay, we saw you yesterday on IG Live with uh, Devontae Smith. Have a lot of guys that are currently in the league reached out. And, uh, have you had a conversation like that a lot? Um, that that was like a um, nil deal that I still got going on because they just finished the shoe that um, in state had dropped for me. So that was like the last part of my um, deal with them. But I've been training with like Calvin Ridley, Jerry Judy, Jalen Water, and I we've just been working together at home. Awesome. Great. Last one or two for Zay. What have you learned from those guys? Um, just take care of your body, and work, and you're gonna last. This is a big grind. A lot of. Combine, Shrine Bowl, all that, and then you got to go to training camp and the season, and all that. How are you kind of mentally preparing yourself to, you know, stay strong all the way throughout? I mean, I love ball, so every part of it I enjoy. It's not a part that I didn't enjoy, so I'm just keeping enjoying the process and just keep looking ahead for the next thing. Thanks, right. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you. Yeah.